are just about to go for a walk with Millie. I'm just waiting for Alexis to get dressed because she's sat on Minecraft yet again. Um, so we're just gonna have a little walk around the block because Millie needs to get out. We've actually had quite a busy morning because um, we went to the little coffee morning that they run once a month here. Um, we've li it's literally next door. So met like a lot of local people, which was really nice. Everybody's interested in yoga, so I'm so looking forward to setting up my yoga classes. And then Matt um, wanted to put the new oven on, <clears throat> but it was broken. So he had to refit the old one, which he'd just taken off. Um, now uh, oh, the new one's got to go back and they should hopefully send a new replacement. So Matt's just pulled this out of the box and it is broken. So that was going to be our new hob. He's put the wardrobe doors on um, all while I was cooking and watching the kids. I say the kids because Millie is a kid. Um, so yeah, we've just eaten and now we're about to go for a little walk. Good thinking. I think the rain is coming. <laughs> I'm running. It's a graveyard, babes. You did very good walking all that way, sugar. So that was a nice little walk around. It took us like an hour and a half to do it. It's quite a long walk to be honest with Alexis. She did amazing. Um, Millie is absolutely soaking now. So we're gonna see if we can light the fire. Uh, we don't really have enough wood or the right wood, but we're gonna try. Um, and then Matt's got to sort out the plug sockets, hold on a second babes, um, because there's three plugs, there's three plug sockets that are like hanging off the wall, so he's gonna sort those out as well, and then uh, that's like the big major stuff done. It's gonna take us a little while to get used to this country farm lifestyle out here. <laughs> Last night I was downstairs and Matt's like, Leah, 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 so I run upstairs and there were sheep outside. Since Who do we when, know that have sheep? <laughs> since when do you get sheep just wandering around? I'm going to have to go and um, ask people if their sheep are loose. And uh, we're like, okay, obviously there's not meant to be sheep outside, so we didn't know what to do. I had the number of the lady who I messaged in for the hall next door to teach yoga, so I messaged her like, 
just to let you know, there's sheep outside and I can't see anybody about, so I'm not sure if they're meant to be there. And then Matt runs around to all the farms. Nobody's home apart from the neighbours opposite. So they come out and then, yeah, basically the sheep has gone into another field and it's like, well, we don't know whose they belong to. So they're in the field for now. So hopefully they're still there. I've been keeping an eye out today just to see if I see them wandering around. But yeah, we still don't know whose they are. So in a little bit, me and Matt and Alexis are going to go to Tesco because we've got to get a little bit of shopping. Um, I think the nearest one is half an hour away, so just going to drive to there and come back because we've got um, my other family coming out today. Well, my mum and dad's coming back out and my brother's coming to see the place. So I'm also going to do a quick tidy up because this place is an absolute tip as best I can anyway. It's still not like... You know, everything's still not in the place it should be. Like, the yoga room is still filled with boxes. Um, but I'm going to do a quick clean, and then we've got family coming out to see the place. We finally have curtains! <laughs> it's so nice having curtains. <laughs> We've been, like, keeping the light off because, obviously, it's pitch black outside at night. So, if you have the light, on, everyone can see right in. So, <laughs> we've finally got curtains up, so that's good. I say everyone. There's only one, two houses there that I could see in anyway. Um, so yeah, this this room is coming on. We just got to get the door handles for the wardrobes. Um, but yes, it's it's looking so good. I just can't wait to paint the walls. Well, I say paint. Um, is that wallpaper? Yeah. It's all wallpapered, isn't it? It's all wallpapered. Okay. I think even mm, the ceiling might be wallpapered. I think it might be. Okay, wallpaper off everywhere. Paint it, probably plaster it first. Paint it, new carpet, new bedding, and it's gonna look amazing in here. My little boho room is coming on. So good. So yeah, family came around today and um, just showing them around. Alexis was making a little, um, what do they call it, a den out in the, in the trees which is nice um so we didn't we didn't get any of that in Plymouth like if you wanted to go to the woods you had to walk down the road like there were woods there but you had to walk down the road so um you know they couldn't just do it in the garden so that's really nice so they were doing that uh we had a little cake because it's mine and my mum's birthday on Wednesday um so yep born on the same day <laughs> so that was a nice present for my mum so yeah, it's been it's been a really good day. Um, yet again, the day is just whizzed by. We've got another week of Easter holidays right now. Um, so I'm not sure what we're going to do. We didn't do much last week because we wanted to kind of settle into the house. And to be honest, I think Alexis is still settling in and I don't want to um, overwhelm her. So we probably will just have another like chilled week. I do want to drive around to see if I can see the school. Um, because it is somewhere that I'm going to have to keep driving to. So I want to just check like parking and stuff like that. I get a bit anxious about stuff like that. Like I need to know exactly where I'm going. I need to know where I'm going to park. And yeah, it also just stresses me out. Um, so yeah, all going well here in our little country farmhouse.